Hello friends. So we are going to be doing some blending. So we will be practicing some review sounds that we have learned in unit four. The long A as in the word train. The long E as in the word tree. The long I as in the word five. The long O as in the word boat. So remember, the way we do it, in, we'll do it just the way that we do it in class. I will say the word, you will say the word. I will break it up into its sounds. After each sound, repeat after me. I will then write it in my journal. You can write it in your journal as well. The first word, may, say may, m, a, may. So the m, m, and a is that long a sound and we will spell that long A with the A Y. So let's blend. M A May. The next word, play. Pull. It's the P L. Remember, P says P. L says O. P O. Pull. And then we have that long A again also spelled with a y pull a play and terrain terrain tur t er tur and then that long a which will be spelled a i tur a tray and then m which is that n sound so, tur, a, n, train. Next word, April, like our month. So it must be capitalized. So April is spelled with that lonely a, a, p, a, p, er, a, per, I, o, April, April. Now we're gonna do some practice with the long E sound. So our first word, me, M, mm, and then long E spelled with that lonely E, M, mm, E, me. Next word. C. S. E. C. Now the word C will be spelled with that double E. Each. E. Which will be spelled with that E A. And then cha, cha. That is C H. E ch, each. Next word, thief, th, th. that is the T-H, E, E, one of the ways we can spell that long E is I, E, th, E, f, f, that F, th, E, f, thief, thief. We're now going to practice some words with long O. So that long O sound says its name, O. First word is old, old. So that lonely O. And then old, old. L, D. L says O, D says duh, O, duh, old. So the word O, old, old, old. And boats, boats, ba, ba. 
So B O, one of the ways we can spell that long O is O A B O and T T. That's a T. So right now, B O T boat, that is one boat. If we would like to make it say two boats or more than one boat, we would add an S. And then we would have ba o -ts, boats, boats. Next word, show, show. Remember, S-H will say sh. And then another way to spell long O, O-W, sh, O, show, show. And next word, Joe. Joe is a name, so we will have to capitalize that J. J, J. O. And o, E is another way to spell that long O. J, O, Joe. Now we're going to practice with some long I words. First word, mild, mild. So that first sound, M, mm, M. Mm. That is M. M, mm, I, I. In the word mild, that I is going to be lonely I. And just like in the word old, I hear the old. M, mm, I, old, old. Mild. Let's blend. M, mm, I, old, mild, mild. So the next word will be sky. Sky. So I hear s, ka, ska, s says s, k says ka, s, ka, ska. And then another way to spell that long I is with a Y all by itself. Ska, I, sky. Next word, sigh, sigh. So I hear that s at the end, at the beginning. I, I. So in the word sigh, we have I, G, H that is going to make that long I sound. All three of those letters work together to say I, S, I, sigh. Now when you have I, G, H as the long I sound, you do not hear the G or the H. You only hear that I sound. G and H stay silent in that sound. Next word, spied, spied. So I hear sp, sp, s says s, p says p, s, p, sp. And another way to spell that long i, sp, i, i, e, sp, i, d, d. Going to be a d. Now let's blend. Sp, I, D, spied. So you may notice that in the word spied, we have long I spelled with I, E. And also in the word thief, we have long E spelled with I, E. So we have two spelling patterns that make two, two different sounds. So we have to make sure that we can switch those because if we had the long I here, th, I, f, th, I, f, oh no, that doesn't sound right. So now let's try it with a long E. Th, e, f, thief. Oh yeah, that sounds like a word that I know. Okay, so now we're going to do a couple of sentences. Everybody's favorite part. So the first sentence or the first word, Duh. D will say duh. Wa. Duh. Wa. Dwa. Okay. Dwai. I. And in, the, in this word, I G H is going to make that long I sound. Dwa. I. Dwai. And what does the T make? T. Let's blend the whole word. Dwa. I, T, Dwight. 
Now remember, every sentence begins with a capital letter, and this word Dwight is capitalized for two different reasons. It is a name. P, sp, now in this word that I, E, is going to say the long E sound, or no, the long I sound, I'm sorry. Sp, I, D, spied, so we have Dwight, spied. A, M says, mm. we're going to have a short O here, short O, what does that say again? Aw, mm, aw, we'll have TH says, f, f, mm, aw, f, moth. And then teeny tiny word, by, another teeny tiny word, high frequency word, the, what's that? L says ol, and IGH will say what sound? Long I, ul, I, lie. And T says what sound? Ta. O, I, ta. Light. And then what will every sentence end with? A period. So let's go ahead and read our sentence. Let's use our blending skills. Dwight spied a moth by the light. So now we'll do everyone's favorite part, nouns and verbs. So I'd like you to take an orange crayon so that we can circle the nouns. So remember, a noun is a person, a place, or a thing. So use orange for your nouns and use blue for your verbs. And we'll come back to that in just a minute. Okay, next sentence. One here. And next sentence. So there's that J, J, J. Then we're going to have a long O spelled with O E, J, O, Joe. Now, Joe is also a name. That is why it is capitalized. It is also the beginning of a sentence. So double reason to be capitalized. Use, Joe use. Oh, that doesn't sound right. I need to say Joe used, Joe used. So that's taking that high frequency word use and adding a D, used, used. And we, though, we know that to make a word, uh, the past tense, we would add ED. But since there's already an E in the word use, we will just add a D to make used, used. And S will say S. And we're going to have a long O sound. 
which will be spelled O-A, like the boat card. And then P will say P, S, O, P, soap, soap. And then teeny tiny word, high frequency word, two, and then C L K U L K U L, and then we're going to have that long E sound spelled E A K U L. E, N, mm, clean. And then teeny tiny word, high frequency word, the, B will say, B, lonely O will say, O, That O-W is going to say it in this word. B-O. And then L will say O-L. B-O-O-L. Bowl. Bowl. So let's read what we have. Make sure you use your blending skills. Joe used soap to clean the bowl. Now what is my sentence missing? Hmm. Go ahead and tell someone in your house what our sentence is missing. It is missing a period. That's right. Joe used soap to clean the bowl. So make sure you will use orange for your nouns and blue for your verbs. Okay. So let's go back to that first sentence and we'll check your work. So in this sentence, Dwight spied a moth by the light. Our first noun, Dwight, and I'm sure you all had an orange box around the word Dwight. Now what is another noun in this sentence? Remember a noun is a person, a place, or a thing. Moth, moth is also a thing. It is something you can touch, but I don't suggest touching one. Dwight spied a moth by the light. Hmm. In this sentence, light is a noun. That's all of our nouns. Now let's look for our verbs. Verbs. So remember, a verb is an action. What is happening in the sentence? There is only one verb in our sentence. The verb is spied, spied. Because that is what Dwight is doing. Dwight spied a moth by the light. And in number two, Joe used soap to clean the bowl. So our nouns, our nouns. The first one, Joe, that is a person. That is what our sentence is about. Now what else, what are my other nouns? Used, no, I don't think that's a noun. Soap, I know that I can touch soap. I can use it to wash my hands. Soap is a noun. Two. No, I know that's not a noun. Clean. No, I don't think that's a noun either. The bowl. Well, I know that a bowl is something I can touch. I can have my ice cream or my cereal in a bowl. So that's all of our nouns. Let's look for our verbs. Now, remember, a verb is an action. So Joe is going to use, he used the soap to clean. 
Now is clean something that we can do? It sure is. The, no, I don't think the is a verb. It's not something I can do. Is the word to a verb? No, I don't think so. Okay, friends. So what I would like you to do in your journal, I would like you to write the blending board and I would like you to practice saying each word to someone in your house. So let's go ahead and read the words one more time. Read along with me. May, play, train, April, me, see, each, thief, old, boats, show, Joe, mild, sky, sigh, spied. Now our sentences. Dwight spied a moth by the light. Joe used soap to clean the bowl. All right, friends, thank you so much for participating in our blending lesson. Now go ahead and write the words in your journal and read them to someone in your house.